Now, the threat of violence in schools has forced a number of area districts to put a renewed focus on safety. And one of those being Adrian High School, Michael Sandlin, shows us new technology designed to stop someone who is in the school with a gun. Michael, what makes this stand out? Well, Kaylee, unlike other schools that buy metal detectors or school resource officers, Adrian High School has invested in an AI camera system that detects guns the moment they're drawn and calls first responders before the shooter can pull the trigger. In a half mile long high school with roughly 800 students, knowing what's going on all over the building isn't easy even on a quiet day. So in a real emergency, what's the quickest way to know if someone has brought a weapon to the school? We know in these situations, uh, time is of the essence. Adrian School District Superintendent Kevin Parker says the answer is an AI-based technology installed in the school's camera system called Zero Eyes, installed in August. The AI picks up that there's a weapon. It then in the command center, it lights up a screen and then the, the command center, they see where it is and, and what's going on. And then there's an alert system to building administrators. There's a whole list of people that they contact at that time, including local law enforcement, so that there's an can be a, an immediate response. With Zero Eyes installed in all 148 cameras inside and outside of the building, Adrian staff say gone are the days where you have to wait for the shooting to start to know there's a threat. The AI will contact the police the moment it recognizes a gun. It's something the district bought late last year when the state gave out six-figure checks to schools to bolster safety. High school principal Sam Skeels was involved in that process of how to spend it. And he says as both an educator and a father of three Adrian students, he wanted something cutting edge. You know, you could talk about metal detectors or all types of different things. This was, for me, the best option personally because it's it's a proactive means. If we can identify something before it's even coming to the building, that's huge. As Skills rooms the hall, saying hello to students. What's up, girls? How we doing? What's up? I'm good. How are you? Good. He tells me he feels safer knowing there's another pair of eyes watching, seeing the things he might miss, and making sure the school is staying a step ahead because they can't afford to be a step behind. Unfortunately, the, the times that we live in, as long as folks are willing to, you know, do awful things, we need to be prepared, especially in schools, to keep kids safe. Fortunately, uh, the superintendent and the principal tell me that right now they haven't detected any guns so far. Also, one of the other four schools in the state using Zero Eyes include Oxford High School, which installed the tech just a year after the 2021 mass shooting on their campus that saw four dead and seven injured. In studio, I'm Michael Sandlin, WTOL 11.